this evening, I'm in Zana in the Ivy in Victoria. That's correct. That's yes, correct. I've got something right down. I'm amazed. See, we booked this the other day. Um, obviously, it's still the dine in, eat out, help out, thinking of Bob. So, we thought, why not? So, I've gone for a burger. And Dan, what have you gone for? Shepherd's pie. Dan's gone for shepherd's pie. So, fingers crossed they come out soon because I'm starving. <laughs> two slings, ivy slings, like a Singapore sling, but a little bit different. Come on, what the difference is, I think it's just the gin. My burger's arrived, it's like a deconstructed burger, so I'll build it up again. And the chips look amazing, so. Uh -huh. Dan, your shepherd's pie. So let's tuck in. So look, normally you get a tiny bit of bread, don't you, on the yeah. bread selection. We got a loaf. And it's warm as well. Look how beautiful that looks. That's a salted sourdough. Was that no elegant way of taking it We're going to give it a taste for it, Georgie. Sure. That's <laughs> oh, <so> elegant. I <laughs> know. Oh, I don't usually like sourdough, do I? No. I don't know it's because it's warm, it's really nice. Plus it's covered in salt. Yeah, I recommend. So how was your burger, Georgie? The burger was really nice. It was really nice to me. There wasn't much crystal in it either. It's a really loud car. But the red onion was like the spiciest red onion I've ever had in my life. Oh. It was really weird, wasn't it? And how was that loaf of bread? Oh my god. <laughs> um, usually when you go to a restaurant and you get a side of bread, I'm just watching because that dessert's going to come any second. Um, and you get a, sl like a slice of bread, it's a couple of slices, but it was a whole loaf, so we finished, don't mind. And how was my shepherd's pie? I didn't enjoy your shepherd's pie that much. <laughs> it tasted right because it had beef and lamb in it. I'm yeah, not I'm, lamb. it wasn't the best shepherd's pie I've ever had. No. It was tasty, but it was okay. Nothing special. It was nice though, it was nice service in there too. Yeah, so. We've got a nice little outside bar area. We should just come out here to chill for a bit before we get our dessert. Georgie, you've ordered yet another Ivy Sling mm -hmm. slash Singapore Sling. The funny thing is. You're settled. I, I don't drink that often because I can feel the other one already. But I know there's loads of different things in it, isn't there? Yeah. Um, spirits, so. What's in it? There's gin, brandy. I don't think so. Like. I don't know what's. I can't remember what's in it. Is it, it on this menu? Yeah. No. Oh. I think it's like gin. I don't know. I really don't know. Then. <laughs> Put it in below. Yeah. Ding. <laughs> so I don't think I'm not that hungry. So I think we're gonna share a dessert. You up to share a dessert? Yeah. Cool. And I want to order the most fancy one, please. I'm guessing that's the. The chocolate bomb. It's bomb with an E though, so is it bomb B? Bomb A. <laughs> boom. <laughs> chocolate boom. <laughs> let's order then. Yeah, let's do it. So the desserts come. Usually they pour in like hot caramel sauce for you. Imagine because it's really hot. Yeah, don't burn yourself. Kind of. um, but Dan awkwardly asked if we could do it ourselves for the purpose of this video. So watch this go wrong. Okay, you ready? Um, so nervous, Let me get into it. Right. right over the middle. Oh, 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 oh. I think she would have done it better. She would have done it so much better, Dan. Oh, look at it. Look at all that gooeyness. Isn't it pretty? Georgie, you are officially now a waiter at the Ivy. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> yum, 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 yum. <laughs> so that was a nice dinner in the Ivy. It was. Obviously, we're the next day now, but we forgot to close it, didn't we? <laughs> um, I really enjoyed it. It was a nice kind of atmosphere. Service was a little bit slow, but I think because we were upstairs, um, there's only one waitress or waiter per, like, the whole upstairs. Compared to downstairs, there's quite a few, isn't there? So that's probably why. But it came to £56. We got £20 off because the out help out scheme. Um, but I think it's really fairly priced, the food is really nice, and we'll definitely eat there again. You just answered all my questions. Oh, did I? What did you like most? Oh, it had to be the dessert. The, uh, the caramel sauce and the chocolate kind of 
chocolate bomb, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah that, that was really nice. What Definitely have that again. What did you like least? I mean, the chips on my burger were a little bit cold. So that's probably the least favourite thing of the meal was chips. What would you rate it out of five? Uh, I'm going to say a four. Why? I think like £13 isn't bad for a burger in London, regardless of like what the name of the place is called. But yeah, I think it's because of the slower, slower service, probably. I'll probably give it a four. So thanks for watching. We do hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And we'll see you later. Mm -hmm.